Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alex and welcome back everybody to The Walking Dead on the Seaport map. Guys, I honestly am just super happy to see that we actually hit that 100 like goal. Uh, to me, when I saw it, I actually got a little bit emotional just to see that 100 likes um, for something that I worked hard on. And just seeing that a lot of people really do enjoy the series and the episode I uploaded... Um, that to me is something that's really special and I hope that you guys can see that. It's kind of difficult to express it through my own words, I guess, but the amount of um, appreciation I have for the support you guys left on the last episode and on The Walking Dead in general, the series, has just blown my mind away. And um, I just say thank you guys so much for it. I will do something special, like I mentioned, the giveaway rank. That will be coming this weekend as soon as I can get my hands on um, just a rank to give to some people. Maybe I'll give away two ranks because your support in two days reached 100 likes. I mean, that to me is astonishing and I don't think I could have asked for more. That's just amazing. And we also reached 4,700 subscribers as well and that's something that continues to blow my mind away. That, you know, there's so much success coming from this series that it's something I love to upload. And it's something that you guys love to watch. And I think that's the best connection between viewers, sub subscribers, supporters, and I guess me, the uploader, the YouTuber, if you want to call such. So I just want to thank you guys so much for that. And if you guys can continue hitting that 100 likes per episode, uh, that would just knock me out of the just just knock me out because that's just something that I would love to see more often. And um, it's amazing. So I want to say thank you guys so much for what you guys have done to me. It just means the world. You know, a lot of YouTubers, 100 likes maybe is nothing. But for me, just seeing that after a long time of months without reaching really 100 um, likes, you know, it just shows me that you guys really do care about this series. And I'm never going to let it go. I promise you guys that. So in today's episode, I want to mention a few things. I don't have any of my gear on me. It's all gone because I died. Uh, I died off screen. I was setting up and uh, yeah, that happens. I died and it does it does suck a little bit, but we did have not we didn't have as many things that was gonna be needed, I guess to survive. We just had a few wep weapons and some food and such. But this is good enough, I think. So we're gonna actually go and explore just a little bit more around here. And it's going to be pretty interesting, just exploring more around the Walking Dead server and seeing what we can use. Yes, we got a sledgehammer. That's basically what we got in the first episode, which is kind of interesting. It's kind of neat, to be honest. Um, and we're actually going to go around, explore more, and we're going to see what we can find. Hopefully, we can check out some new buildings and um, check out some new builds, some new areas that can have more loots for us. So that's going to be quite a cool journey, I think, in my opinion. Uh, and let's keep looking around here, seeing if there's anything. Yep, diamond loot. That's good. Oh, yes, soldier gear. That's going to be cool, actually. Oh, I don't want to go to bed. No, leave bed. No. Um, soldier gear. How does it look, actually? Let's check this out. Oh, now that is awesome. We have a pretty cool soldier gear right there, guys. Um, that's top of the notch. That is awesome stuff. All right, all we need right now is food. Uh, we're very low on food. Um, that's actually something I was not expecting to be this soon. Uh, so we're going to have to go kill this pig over there. Um, the only source of food that's around here at the moment, but we're obviously gonna go and get some more now I got some amazing news uh, something that I was gonna let you guys know a little bit later into the episode But I want to let you guys know now because this news is gonna be something that may shock you guys may not shock you guys Oh boy, there's a lot of walkers in here, uh, but I want to let you guys know that um, Because of your support and how much this series has been doing so well on the channel SGC Barbarian contacted me and uh, he asked me if I would like to get a custom kit made. Now, this custom kit is going to be called Dash Kit Alexton. And uh, what it's going to be brought up of is some custom, not custom, but some items that I customly put together to make a really cool kit called Dash Kit Alexton. Now, this kit will actually become available for anyone um, who plays on this server, on the Seaport server. Um, so if you guys want to get that kit, um, eventually when I give the rank giveaway and all that, 
I will let you guys know as soon as possible when this kit is set and ready to go. So we talked about it a couple days ago, um, so it's not entirely set yet. So maybe by the weekend or by the beginning of next week, it should be done or latest by Thanksgiving, I hope. Uh, so it'll be pretty cool and we got to get some food. Is that a person? Yes, it is. I'm not too worried, but I need to get some rotten flesh. Uh, this is the only source. Oh, perfect. We got to eat some rotten flesh because we are very low. Oh, is this person? Oh, I'm not going to attack you, buddy. I'm all good. I'm never going to attack a person who like um wants to not harm me. Again, keep that in mind. Ooh, we got actually no damage from that. That's pretty good. Um, anything else around here? Come on, give me some goods. Uh, oh, there's some few around here. Hopefully we can get this. Soda can. Oh, that guy is just trying to get some loots as well. Uh, Walker over there. Um, oh boy, these guys are actually coming all at me. All right, uh, I'll take him on. I'll take him on because we do have to get our humanity up, anyways. And we got to get some PVP in here as well, <laughs> just a little bit. And we got some water bottle. Hey, dude, how's it going? What's your name? Ice Kid Zero Zero Seven. I'm gonna give you guys a water bottle. You might need a water bottle in the post-apocalyptic world. You might get thirsty. Um, and yeah, I hope that helps you. Um, so let's keep going, get that pig. Man, there's really not a lot of loot. So we're gonna go in something cool, and it's the mall. Uh, if not the mall, we're gonna go to something like Petco. Hopefully they have some food. Was that? No food was dropped from that pig. Interesting. Come on, give me some food. I need something. Alright, there we go. Some pork chop. It's not cooked, but it's good enough. It's gonna last us just a little bit. Um, alrighty. I should give him the golf club. Ah, whatever. It's okay now. Uh, so let's eat up here. We are really doing bad on food. This is kind of the first time, actually, in The Walking Dead. Where I've actually been a little bit low on food. Also, I want to talk about more about the kit dash kit Alexton. Uh, basically, you have to play on the seaport map in order to use this kit. I don't think it's gonna be available on any of the other servers unless I talk to SGC Barbarian. Um, so I'll talk to him and see what I could do about that. But if you guys are excited about this kit, let me know in the comment section and also. Uh, just let me know what you think about it. I think it's gonna be pretty cool just to have a kit and I'll let you guys know a little bit a sneak peek of what's inside the kit um, I'm not gonna tell you everything because it'll just give it away So the first thing that's gonna be on there is gonna be a scar now. This is a really good weapon I've used it in the past I really liked it a lot and it's had a lot of cool benefits to it So I will be using it a little bit more often if I get the kit eventually done um, Okay, and also ooh, so I'm dropping some frames here now someone really barricaded this thing really well um, that's interesting. Oh, that person, I hope it doesn't want to hurt me. Okay, cool. Sweet. First person we encountered that didn't actually want to kill me. Uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, we can't get by there. So I mentioned the scar. That's going to be a pretty cool gun. Um, I also have, we're going to go in this apartment building. Hello, anyone? I am here, just a friendly person, uh, roaming around just trying to get some loot. Yes, we got some morphine. Oh boy, I heard a person. I don't want trouble. I don't want trouble. No, I don't want trouble. Oh my gosh, no. Seriously? I said I don't want trouble. I don't want any trouble. Oh, man. Whoa, whoa. Am I getting sh Was I really getting shot at just now? Okay, this is crazy. This this city, this is what you expect. Oh, boy. There's a person in What the heck? <laughs> oh, my God. Double the deaths. Okay, just kill me. Just kill me. Just do it. Okay, I gave up. You guys got the best of me, man. Everyone in this city is really going at me. And the walkers are going at me right now, too. And this is a perfect location. Oh, boy. This is a good rooftop right here. Okay, we're all set. We just gotta get some bandages. Um, oh, don't die now. Don't die. Don't die. Hold on, just punch this zombie to death. Walker to death. Or kick him off. Okay. Alright, can opener. Good. Let's get some goods here. Um, so as I was mentioning, we got the scar. Um, we also have the 44 Magnum, which is absolutely cool. This pistol, it's super... Uh, it's actually really good for like um, short distance shots, but it's actually amazing. What does this guy want? What do you want? <laughs> Um, what's in here? Bandage. Oh, I need a really- I really do need a bandage now. Uh, let's get out of here. Oh, I need this rag. I need this rag. Oh, it's a dirty rag, though. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. We're gonna get the heck out of here. Okay, this is a big- Oh, boy. If we don't get any weapons or any type of, uh, security here, we're pretty much in trouble now. Got a backpack. We need some water. Oh, boy. Did he die? I don't know. I don't know. I need some safety here. Please give me a bandage. Please give me a bandage. I don't want to die. I really don't want to die. Oh, that's a long way down. Oh, he didn't die. Okay, good. Um, but hopefully he doesn't have a weapon and then kills me. Um, that would just be brutal and mean. Um, come on. We got to find ourselves a bandage here. Need a bandage. Um, does he have one? Oh, that would be the best if he has one. Please give me a bandage. Uh, oh, he doesn't have one. Oh, it's okay, buddy. I, I, I understand. It's tough here. Um... 
that's good. Don't worry about it. I, I don't need it. I don't need your stuff. I will survive. I will survive the post-apocalypse here. Hopefully we find some type of uh, medical gear around here. This apartment building does not seem so generous to us, so we're going to most likely die, which is going to suck. But it's okay because uh, we did get to explore this apartment building. Um, handcuffs, not going to be too useful. Um, as, at the moment, it's not going to be too useful. And uh, I'm checking in here. Come on, give us something. I wish I could use a dirty rag, but we can't. Um, this was our only hope, and you know what? We can get out of here. We have to make it out of here. Okay, we're gonna go and somehow rush out of this place. Maybe we can find here another dirty rag. A base part door. Oh, man, this is really brutal. Oh, we're gonna die. It's okay. Well, at least I gave it my best shot. I couldn't do anything about it unless we find something here. Uh, this is our last hope right here. Another dirty rag. All the trolls here. The dirty rags. That's all we're getting. Um, so let's continue looking here. Nothing. Nope. Well, it was nice knowing this place. We're gonna die now. It's it's just we've been dying all day in this episode. I can't do anything about it, to be honest. But um, it's okay. Dash R spawn. All right, back in here, and we're back in the same apartment building. Now this sucks. Uh, let's get out of here. I don't want to be in here. I just want to get the heck out of this place and never see it again. Uh, also, I want to continue talking about the Dash Kid Alexon because I did get distracted from all these deaths that occurred. I do apologize about that. Uh, but inside the kits, they're actually gonna be. Uh, the Scar, the 44 Magnum, you guys are gonna get a camo gear. Um, I don't know what camo gear yet, but it's gonna be something pretty cool, I hope. Um, also, you guys are gonna get two ammos for the, um, 44 Magnum. And I am gonna get this bandage here. And I'm getting the heck out of here now. So you guys got the 44 Magnum, you got the camo, you guys got a canteen, you guys have a, some type of, whoa boy. Oh boy. By the way, oh, are you serious? Oh, come on, this is really becoming to get on my nerves now. I want to create the biggest clan here now. Dash L. Am I allowed to create a clan? Yes, we are. Okay. Create clan. We're going to name it Foxy. Um, and then I'm eventually going to invite people to the clan. Uh, we don't have anyone yet on the server that I trust currently, but I will add a lot of people. And I promise you guys that. We are no longer going to die from these bandits. That's it. I promise you guys. We got a weapon, a crowbar, some rotten flesh. Um, I mean, it's a dead piece of food that we don't need rotten food, I meant. Um, and hopefully we can get some more around here. Empty juice pouch, not gonna do us any good. So let's get out of here now. Now, I believe this is the same apartment building that we did die in. So hopefully we can find some more loots around here, and it'll be all good and dandy. Uh, I wanna go down to the lowest floor. I don't really wanna be up to the top. I wanna kinda go a little bit down and see what's going on here. Alright, cool. Um, so yeah, th that's what the kit's gonna have. I'm not gonna tell you everything. There's gonna be- oh, more bandages. Good, we need that. Um... And I don't, again, I don't want to really give you guys everything that's going to be on there. Uh, there will be a compass. I want to give you guys that because that really is helpful. I use it a lot. Uh, if I had one on me, I would have showed you guys how useful it is. But I don't. It just helps you guide your way through the city. And it just gives you guys a better understanding of where you are. And uh, kind of allows you to understand how many people are in a certain area. Uh, in a way. Because if you see this area that's more crowded, you will know for sure that there's something going on over there. So let's get out of here and go out inside to the open because I don't like these places. They're full of ban- They're full of bandits. This is the moment, guys. Oh, yes, kill him, kill him, kill- I think he died, though. I think he died. Oh, man, I had to do it. We had to try to get some, some type of, uh, I guess, revenge, but we couldn't get it. So that's that. Finally, we are here in the open, guys. Alright, so I'm never gonna die again. I'm gonna try to stand to that statement, and hopefully we don't die again. Um, and that would be the best way to go around things. Now, I wanna go and explore around the more suburban areas. Kind of like, the areas where it's a little bit less populated. Like, for example, this big building here. I know 100% sure there's probably a lot of snipers up there. There's a lot of bandits. Maybe there's a lot of good people too. But I want to keep my distance away from anyone at the moment until we get a clan going. Now, this clan is going to be made up of people that's been in the past clans and also the new people as well from you guys who are watching the video. So it's going to be pretty interesting. I think it's going to be a cool way to get stronger on this seaport map because as you can see, there are a lot of, um, a lot of bandits. I don't know if they're good people or just killing good people because I don't know if they know I'm a good person. I'm not really a bad person. Uh, but I hope they understand that I am not here to harm them. I'm here to survive the walkers That's kind of all I'm doing here as you guys can see so uh, that's that um, I hope that you guys will join the clan. I will be doing an invitation uh, probably in the next episode or two 
So that's going to be quite interesting. Um, I want to go find ourselves a weapon because we have not used any guns yet. Because we could not find any ammo. And that's to do the fact that I don't have a kit yet. Um, so I'll be talking to SGC. Oh, look at this. This is going to be pretty cool down here. This looks like it's a downstairs basement. Hopefully we can find some loots down here. I think we'll be able to find something that's going to be useful. Um, we basically have food, a can, and uh, a bandage, a rag. Nothing to really give ourselves a uh, defense. Oh, what is this? A weapon. We have ourselves a gun. Our first gun that we have no ammo in. Um, so we're going to have to use this gun and hopefully find some ammo. Um, what is this? Okay, there's some more good things around here. Uh, what is this? A bandage. Good. We do need a bandage because there's a lot of walkers in this city. And a lot of bandits I actually shoot you down, which kind of sucks. I don't like that at all. So, ooh, that's basically all in this area. So let's get the heck out of here and go for some more little buildings. It's turning night, which is kind of good because you kind of can stay a little bit camouflaged, in my opinion. Um, oh, there's uh, more walkers down the road. I want to go around the edges here and see what we can find. Hopefully we can find a little alleyway with some good loots. Um, I know that this uh, park here, if you want to call it so, uh, has some good uh, loots inside there. So we'll probably eventually head out over there. Uh, let's go in here and find some type of weapon. Now, I just heard a lot of walkers come behind me. And I know for sure you guys just saw them. If not, then there are a good amount of walkers right behind us uh, chasing us down. And we need a stick. Okay, baseball bat. Sweet. Let's bash this, bash this walker to pieces. There we go. All right. Um, and if I actually do need to eat, so let's eat right now. Hurry up. Oh boy, there's some more walkers coming our way. Let's take them out, and hopefully we're gonna go inside this little stage. Oh man, we're losing blood already. I'm gonna use the rag. Uh, I don't want to really use anything else. I don't want to use that kit right now. Oh, there's a lot of walkers in here, guys. That's 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 trouble. That's trouble. We gotta get out of here. Um. Hopefully we can find some type of little area to keep us safe from them. And we can drop in a lot of frame rates. Sometimes that happens. I don't know why. Wooden stick. Not going to do us any good. Oh boy, we are going to get heck out of here. Um, we are getting chased by a good amount of walkers right now. Uh, let's go to the boat here. I think we'll be safe if we jump over. And that will kind of keep us a little bit safe from any dangers around that are still chasing us. Yep, they're still chasing us. Uh, let's jump down. And we're going to go onto this boat and kind of keep a little bit some safety and find out if we can find any type of weapons on here. Uh, we do have the gun, the stick, and the bat. The bat. That's all it is. Not even a bat with the nail. So that's what's keeping us alive currently. Um, that looks like a person. She probably looted this place out. I am not here to harm you at all. I am here just to keep peace. I don't want any... Is she going to punch me? Hi. How's it going? How's it going? My name is Alex, and I'm here in the post-apocalyptic world. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go back here. At, what? It's time? Why does she say time? Is it? It's not time. It's. I don't know what it is. I. Oh, what time of the day? I don't know. It's a post-apocalyptic world. I got no idea what I'm. What, what time it is? I. I lost track of that. Um. But what I gotta find is some type. Are we gonna be able to make this jump? Yes, we are. Hopefully, we can find ourselves something. And jump over. No, we just failed that. Well, I guess I have to go from the edges. I'm not sure how this works out. Uh, oh, wait. I don't know how to get over this. Is this just not... I don't know. I'm just not going to deal with it right now. I don't want to... Oh, oh, there's a person over there. Oh, he's he's a dangerous one. He's a dangerous one for sure. So I want to get my distance away from him. I want to get ourselves a safe area. Yes, okay, we got something over here. Uh, we got to get some food. We got to regen. Another baseball bat. Mm, not the best. There's a walker over there. Hopefully he didn't see us. If he did, it's not a big deal because we'll be able to take him out uh, for sure. Okay, yes, some protein. We'll take it. Candy bar. I'm going to eat it up. Hopefully it gives... What is this? A... There's a shop in here? I never knew of this, guys. Okay, this is something new. I never... Is this actually... So... This is a... Uh, what the heck? No, we got to save him. No! Oh, man, that sucks. He's going to have to die. I don't know if he's going to die. Maybe he's just not going to die. Um, but that's actually pretty cool. I never knew about this till now. So maybe you guys will know about it now, too. Uh, let's put this backpack on just so we can look more official. And we're going to hold a gun just in case anyone wants to attack us. We'll be like, we have a gun with no ammo. But it will look tempting, hopefully. Um, let's go through this area here. Maybe there's going to be something around the edges here. Oh, there's a lot of walkers there. And I wonder if there's someone going to pass by. Uh, oh, someone is bleeding out. Someone is bleeding out, guys. Let's go find out what's going on. Oh, boy. This is actually kind of interesting here. Who is injured? Oh, someone just died. So maybe we can find some loot from them. Just clear out everything that was near them. Um, let's take them out. Let's take these guys out one by one. Oh, boy. They're getting closer and closer. 
Oh boy. Oh no, that guy. He killed me earlier. He actually did kill me. You killed me earlier, buddy. You killed me earlier. And you know it. And you know it, buddy. And you know it for sure. I'm not going to kill you because I'm a good person. But you know for sure that you killed me. I remember seeing him and he did kill me. Uh, but we're going to go off and continue searching around here. Uh, I really, really need to find some type of military gear here. Uh, we will get a kit. We got a bandage. Yes. Anything that's a bandage is actually good with me. Uh, let's go find some more things around here. This is like the railroad area. Um, it's pretty cool. Like the more industrial site of things. Um, interesting enough. Uh, is that guy following me? No, just the walkers. Oh, he is following me. What does he want? I hope he doesn't want to kill me because he knows I'm not here to kill people. I'm here to fight off walkers. That's my job. That's my duty. Um, if he does come back and kill me, that that would be something I'll be shocked about. Uh, so he looks like he's separated from me. So I'm going to go keep my distance. And we're going to go find a location to settle off for the next episode uh, that we're going to do. So that's my goal. Also, if you guys haven't hit that like button yet, please hit it, guys. It does mean the world to me. As I mentioned, um, it just it's awesome. Hey, how's it going, buddy? I'm not going to kill you. Don't run away. I'm not going to kill you. Ah, uh, well, it's okay. That's why we're gonna have to make a clan and dominate this place and just destroy all these bandits that scare all these people that are trying to survive just like we are. And if you guys are wanting to join my clan and you guys are good people, then let me know in the comment section and as soon as I get on and I see your IGN, I will make sure to add you right away to the clan because there's some cool things happening. But I did hear that there's gonna be an update to the clan and let's go to Lowe's, guys! For the last building we're gonna check out, we're gonna go to Lowe's. And we're gonna take show this, show this walker who's boss here. Um... All right, there we go. We, we're gonna take you out. So we're gonna go and check out Lowe's. Hopefully they have some little like type of weapons here. They should. I mean, they should have some four by fours. <laughs> that would do some good. Um, but I don't know. Maybe there's really nothing in here. Uh, but I hope there is. Yes, there are some loots. A nightstick. Okay, that's decent. But I believe the bat does a little bit more damage. Uh, I can't stand my ground on that comment. But maybe it does. Empty water bottle. There's more storage units up around here. Soda can. Um, let's check the aisles one more time before we get out of Lowe's. Um, all right, let's keep looking. Maybe there's some more things around here. Looks like it's been looted out though, um, or it's been I don't know. Oh yes, some red gear. What do we got here? Yes, a makeshift splint. That's good because I kind of break my legs often, and you guys probably have seen that a couple times in the pre past previous times. And also, a comment that you guys asked in the comment section was why can't we? Uh, why don't I open any of the chests? Well, because you can't open any of the chests. It's only meant for the loots, so that's that's a tip for you guys, so you guys don't get angry at me when I don't open them or just pass right by them. Uh, I'm just going to go one more time around this area because sometimes they do spawn back. Um, Alright, so that's basically all of this place. Lowe's has been looted out. We have finished the Lowe's section. That's pretty good. Top of the notch stuff over there. Uh, we did get actually some good thing. A makeshift splint. I heard someone. Okay, Walker. And we're going to go quickly into staples it seems like and we're gonna go loot out this area and uh, call it a day call it an episode actually um so hopefully this walker comes nearby and we can take him out slowly there's a lot of empty uh cans which i don't like oh there he is hey buddy come over here don't go you're not checking out you're gonna check out to your death <laughs> uh he was trying to check out looks like he was coming here to get some i don't know Ooh, a tactical laser that's pretty cool i'm surprised they have it in staples i wouldn't expect that there but again, these probably spawn randomly. A juice pouch, finally something that's not empty. They got some computers here we can check out. Ooh, yes, nice. <laughs> Surprise they're not broken or something like that. But it's pretty cool. Fresh orange, nicely done right there. Okay, uh, I'm going to go check everything out one more time. Nothing in these corners. Um, anything around the front here. There could be something around the desks. Probably not. Nope. Oh, yes, there's something he right behind here. Another baseball bat. We keep on getting a lot of baseball bats, which I'm not going to lie is not too bad. Oh, water bottle. Good, so we got a good amount of things. As you guys can see, the most important thing we got was the makeshift splint, a bandage, and our tactical laser, which is freaking awesome. So that's a good start. I think we're going to keep our shelter here in the uh, staples section. So I will be over here, and I'll hold off. Oh, boy. I actually did not see him coming by like that. Um, are there any more people around here? Because I did not see that coming from whatsoever. All right, well, again, I'm going to keep my uh, distance away from the people now. As you guys have seen, I did die a couple times in this episode. Wasn't expecting to die at all, so I do apologize about that. But we're going to keep our distance from them. We're going to stay sheltered in here for a few episodes. Obviously, we're just going to be in this episode, in this area. And then we're going to move out in the next episode and go into the buildings. And hopefully, we can get the kit. And I'll try to show you guys a preview of the kit as soon as I get it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. My name is Alexton. Stay foxy, guys. And make sure you guys hit that like button. 
If you guys like the content, make sure you hit the subscribe button as well. And uh, if you guys are new to The Walking Dead, go check out some of the old videos as well so you guys can get up to date about what's going on on the Seaport map and the previous videos as well. Thank you guys so much again for all your support. Honestly, it just blows my mind away. So I just want to thank you guys again before we end off the video. And leave a comment as well about what you guys enjoyed. Anything? Another tactical laser. Huh, interesting. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. My name is Alex and stay foxy guys. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.